What if I told you that building software applications doesn't have to be a struggle? Well, it doesn't, thanks to SDKs. But what is SDK? How does it work? What are its examples? And how does it differ from API? Keep watching to find out. Hello, and welcome to Mailtrap Videos, where we explore the world of emails. An SDK, or Software Development Kit, is a collection of tools, libraries, documentation, code samples, and APIs that developers use to build software applications for specific platforms, frameworks, or devices. Think of it as kids' craft kits that already include everything you may need to build a robot or decorate the headphones. Similarly, SDKs contain pre-built components and resources that you can tailor to your application or project. Let's take a look at Mailtrap PHP SDK as an example. The README file in the repository serves as a starting point. It includes installation instructions for different HTTP clients to help you integrate Mailtrap with your PHP project. The documentation also contains a simple script you can use to send emails to transactional, bulk, or testing endpoints, as well as other usage examples. Mailtrap PHP SDK is compatible with Laravel and Symfony frameworks and contains dedicated documentation for each. And before we show you how Mailtrap PHP SDK works, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. We have lots of videos explaining complex dev topics, so don't miss them! Now back to explaining how the PHP SDK works. Once you integrate it with your project, you can customize the script by adding multiple recipients, changing the content type, adding attachments, etc. You also need to configure the Mailtrap client to be able to connect with our endpoints. The only thing left after is to hit run and send your emails. So PHP SDK provides a simple way to integrate Mailtrap functionalities into your project, and the same applies to any other SDK out there. But how does SDK differ from API? APIs let your apps communicate with other apps or services, while SDKs are toolkits for building software or application systems, which often contain APIs. Watch our dedicated tutorial to learn what APIs are and how they work. See you there!